Today I am going to continue my discussion on breast implant and the topic is are breast implants safe for us? This is commonly nagging question in everyone's mind while opting for breast augmentation surgery. Hi, I am Dr. Hiran Mejha. I am a cosmetic plastic surgeon practicing at Eterna Vision and Aesthetic Clinic located at Shivalik Madhivanagar, South Delhi. There are few things we need to know before we go for breast implant surgery. Number one is, are they safe for us? So there have been various researches which are going on for this silicon material. And what it has come out to be that silicon is an inert material. It stays in the body and it might lead to a local reaction because of which there's a formation of a capsule around the implant. So this brings about a few effects which can be observed later on. Next thing is, what are the different types of implants available? So there is saline implant and silicone implant. Saline implant costs less, but the satisfaction received by use of silicone implant is immense. Silicone implants are made up of outer shell of silicone, which is filled with a highly viscous gel. Next question which comes to our mind is, will it rupture? So if a good quality implant is being used, the chances of rupture are very less. And what happens if rupture occurs? If there is a rupture, then you might need to undergo another surgery for removal of the implant. Next question is, is cancer associated with breast implant surgery? So there is something called breast implant associated anaplastic glass cell lymphoma. This has come into news for the last 10 years. This has mostly been reported with textured implant and the incidence is very, very low. Researches are still going on. Whatever implants that we are using nowadays are smooth implants and this type of cancer is not being reported with smooth implants. Although anaplastic glass cell lymphoma is a treatable condition and various treatment options are available. Another question which comes to our mind is whether placement of implant hampers the screening of cancer. Screening of cancer is not hampered by implant placement. Maybe it might happen that mammography alone is not sufficient for it and we might need additional modalities to add to screen your cancer. Now next thing is will it interfere with breastfeeding? Normally it doesn't interfere with breastfeeding and you can be happily feed feeding your child if you are going for breast implant surgery. Nipple sensation and sagginess. So this has been reported that due to sudden increase in the size of your breast after implant placement there might be some amount of sagginess and nipple sensation is normally not lost next question is what is capsular contracture so earlier i said that silicon is an inert material but it does incite a local reaction in the local tissue which reacts in the form of formation of a capsule. Once the capsule forms, it makes the tissue harder. So the softness which was there after placement of an implant can change to feeling of hardness and little pain. And gradually you come to know by the change in the shape of your breast and it needs to be removed. So these are the frequently asked questions regarding breast implant and I hope you are clear with it. If you have any doubts, you can write to us in the comment section below. Thank you.